I was thinking, I have a question for you. Yesterday, what is it? When those, when, the, the, <laughs> <laughs> when them hens came out, yeah. was, have you ever seen it where the, because we're trying to basically trick the turkey into thinking there's hens there that they can f Have you ever seen the hen be out there and then they actually yes. are out there f and then you kill them all the f Yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. crazy, dude. Yeah, they, they, yeah. Welcome to Can't Stop the Flop, 2023. So if it wasn't cool enough to have Jim Brewer get his first turkey, we got three new turkey hunters. We got Cole, who plays with the Washington Commanders. He's a linebacker. He grew up in Florida, so he's done some hog hunting over turkey. Caleb Presley at Barstool Sports. And we got Theo Vaughn. I don't know what Theo does, but he's really cool. But they've never turkey hunted. So I think we should get them up just like turkeys. <laughs> that means it's time to go take some heads off some things, boys. We really did wake you up five, ten minutes before time to go, but we do have some coffee in here. Not quite the jump up like Christmas morning when you look and see your toys. Gotta get that first time, gotta get that first initial hook set, then you get excited about getting up, not right now. <laughs> what do you think this morning? I think it feels good this morning. You ready? I'm ready. All right. Are they ready? <laughs> I'm ready to no. kill. Y'all look like y'all done this your whole life, man. That's good. Good. Maybe. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> How'd y'all sleep? Got some training shoes on. Pretty good. But yeah, we used to, we used to not get a whole lot during this time of year. We all you, you're a big napper? Uh, yeah, man, when you get worn out during hunting season, I will. We'll come back and freaking. Oh, we'll good. come back and oh, eat yeah. and go to bed. We do that many times. Yeah. yeah. I might too, but yeah, there's nothing wrong. That's that's a good thing about hunting camp. There ain't that's like the animal. The animals in us loaf during the day. They get in the shade tree. Well, Why not just kind of hunt them while they're sleeping? Right, Isn't that easier? Here. I'm from. I'm from like Daytona Beach area. Technically, oh, okay. that's where they do it a lot in Alabama. Really? Is it it's not, just ain't legal. It's not yeah. legal. <laughs> they got to be a weight to kill well, them. Well, that's <laughs> yeah, they got a train down. Why can't you shoot them? I mean, look like like at me. Think about it. all the serial killers. Wait, everybody goes to bed. They're gonna die. Falls in their wind at night. Yeah. I feel like it's more humane. <laughs> right now, I'm put, them, put them down while they're sleeping. I think it would be. I would rather die someone while I'm sleeping than than well, never be, wake be up, up trying to bone. Yeah, <laughs> get all horned <laughs> up, and then someone kills me. I'd much rather die in my sleep. And what if you got? What if you get wounded? Uh, think about that. Okay. What if you're all happy? Sure. If it's just one I'm good right shot. Down, but let's just say it's Theo who's a little off and shoots. Yeah. And he hurts, you, and you're running around hurting, thinking it went from happy to. Yeah. You just got a bull in your chest and a boner. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of cool because we got Caleb. It's early morning, but you got to realize he did get his start being uh, basically the captain and supervisor of morale. So this actually helps. I'm glad Caleb. Yeah, Caleb we lost. Yeah, I also think we lost every game that year. <laughs> <laughs> but you did it with a smile. True. True. <laughs> no, we're not catching anything. But did, didn't it, didn't 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 UNC turn it around right after that and start winning some? Yeah, right when I left. So that's when I went to the ACC championship the year I left. So think about it though, the attitude completely changed the shifted. Whole, yeah, it changed the exactly. whole. Exactly. We need those ones. Those when we, them, yeah. Yeah. When we got that. Uh, we got a new DC. Yeah. So doesn't he look like a superhero in this outfit? He does, man. It's like I didn't know I was getting. Bro, I'm wearing Captain I'm wearing America. Pants. We're gonna get some freaking raccoons in those traps. <laughs> There's got to be one right here. That one, that turkey yesterday was roosting right there. Man, there's a pile of turkeys down there gobbling. 
I'm not hearing nothing back this way, but I, I don't know. Is that just like a stadium scene? There's not a lot of trees to set by. So if I go, so I wear like a backpack. And then that's just like you can step out on the ground. <laughs> Oh, it's, a strap. it's just a set in. Yeah. 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 in the chamber. The old one's in the chamber. Oh yeah. What is it? Like, like aim at that oak over there that, and, just, and you'll see that red dot. And just shoot? No, no, don't shoot. Don't shoot. No. no don't, don't shoot? Don't keep your cue fang off the trigger. Okay. All right, but see what I'm saying? You can see, you can see the red dot. The red dot on his head if we can get him in. All right. All right. And who's the other team? It's just us. Oh. Um, just us. It's loaded, Cole. Okay. Yours is loaded too, so there's one in the chest. So as long as you're keeping it pointing up or away from anybody. Oh, yeah. Shoot. Shoot. We can get to there. I'd like to hug up next to it. We have to walk quiet and go down to the entrance. If we can get there and drop these down, we got a chance. Yeah. Let's, let's get around this corner, at least in this teardrop. We can always miss. Okay. See him yet? Yes. Is that gobbler? Yeah, it's a long beard. He's strutting on that corner okay. of the wood line. All right, I'm gonna slide him by. Y'all see him? Yes. He's gonna be still as he can. way over there. A 
was it two long beards? It was just one that came out, but there's there's one behind him around the corner that gobbled a second ago. It's gonna be hard. Too much. It's too much, there. Yeah, he came out and he just stopped, stuck his head up, and looked. You know, he didn't like it. Well, they just didn't run in right there. The highlight of today has been getting Cole, who's who's just come off the NFL season, in his uh, toddler pants. Because <laughs> that's all. That's about all you want. <laughs> Those suckers, you can play in them. Yeah, bro. Freaking. <laughs> Dude, what's, what's your shirt say? Can't stop the flop? Yeah. What does that mean? Like when you shoot them, they just start flopping around. I wouldn't know. And, and, <laughs> <laughs> So I just got to turn the safety off and I'm ready to shoot, yep. ready so to kill. As long as this way, when you push it that way, you pull the trigger, it's shooting, it's shooting. I just want to see what happens. I'm not going to shoot, I just want to see what happens. Okay, nothing. Okay. We got a turkey that we saw in the ditch. We literally could have rode, we rode right by him. He didn't even really run. So we're just going to use up here and try to trick him. Theo might hip shoot him. If he's willing to be shot, I'll, I'm willing to shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go get a shot. Use this little cover of this fall ball. I think they were trying to cross. The I can room. see. I can see him right here, Mike. He's way down there. No, no, I'm looking at it. What's it? Isn't there jokes about chickens crossing? Over? They're walking the other way. So. Dying. <laughs> that canal. I don't know if I can get them across or not. Right, don't move, don't move, don't move. It's coming right here too, right here. Coming right here. Just be ready, just be ready, right here. Don't move, just wait, just wait, just wait. Right to the right, right, right. Wait, I'll tell you, we can see him. Right there. Right, wait. Shoot him. You just patched him a turkey, bro. You just got a turkey, too. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did, you, did you get him? Did you get him? <gasps> Holy s***, dude. No. Oh, dude, what's up, bro? What's bro, up? Bro, that shit was my fault. Oh, it's still raining, bro. <laughs> you guys need to wear earplugs oh out here. God. Where we get him at? Right, look, you gnawed him up, son. Perfect. God, good shot, baby. That's like one of your first shots with a shotgun. <laughs> That was my, it was, it was my first shot with the shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, dude. You can't get no better. Get a turkey with Caleb Presley, man. We've all been fans. Sunday conversation, dude. And that then, was my first shot ever with a shotgun. Dude, you freaking smoked him. And if it was cold, we got cold here. He could just rip up a few trees and build us a fire. 
<laughs> the way you held him was insane. Bro, that moment when you were about to pull the trigger, it's like, pull it. It's like, <laughs> Good shot, baby. I hit it, it was like, bro, gun flew up, my ears are ringing. I was like, whoa. Oh, you dropped the I really want Theo to get one, but there's a lot of two-year-olds that want one, too. So. There's a better chance. deserve one, bro. There's a better chance that a two year old could get Theo one. Theo doesn't des deserve one. Theo's like, so we're gonna walk from here to that decoy? Nah. Yeah. I wonder if he, he had to heard that shot, though. Oh, <laughs> dude. That's insane. Are we gonna eat him? We'll eat him today. We'll eat him today. We'll eat him today. We'll fry him up. We'll get Shane to fry him up. Or either this evening. We'll fry, fry him up this evening. Let him marinate a little bit. And some. This is sick. He, and, he's, and, and, and let me tell you, as soon as you eat him, you're gonna definitely want to hunt more because they are delicious, man. They're the best. Pick them up, dude. Bro, let me do it at my own pace, bro. I've never even touched a turkey before. It's a new experience for me. Bro, he's feel. I mean, it's crazy because you see these things on Thanksgiving commercials all the time. <laughs> <laughs> he's probably 18 pounds. Bro, more than that. Yeah. Yeah, maybe 18. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, bro. So, the, so the, all the, the breast is obviously here, mm -hmm. all that in there. And then you'll notice too, like that's his spurs, that's what they fight with. So that's a two-year-old turkey. He's probably, he's two years old, which is well, a, how you he's mature that? just by his spurs. By, by statue, these turkeys down here, these Osceolas, see how black his wings are? Yeah. So that's a true Osceola. That's, these are the hardest to gain access to get. So this is the most prized turkey out of the four. So like in Tennessee, Osceola. there's an Eastern. This is Osceola, so see how black these wingtips are? And the other turkeys are not that black. That, that's, that's a, that's a uh, pretty intimidating task when you never held a firearm and really never been in the woods to, to do that. Bro, I was just shocked. I wasn't even really nervous, but after I did it and the sound of it was like, Bro, bing. if you could have seen your face like when you, after you did it, <laughs> <laughs> you dropped the gun and turned around like, and it was like, a, you know how you, like, you hit a like, ball into the sun, you have no idea where it went? Yeah. Like I shot, I had no idea if I killed it, nothing. Like I guess he said I did. Then I'm about to bring it back. I'm gonna hold it like this, this deal. Bro, I was, I was thinking about going up and I heard, I was, oh my God, there he is. He looked and when he saw me. So he was coming over here to fight. He was coming, I'd called and the only reason I even put, the only reason I hadn't had that decoy was just in case what happened, happened. Like to kind of sometimes with the sun, if they see that first, they might say, oh, it's like a turkey instead of somebody. Mm -hmm. And so it worked. So as I moved, he saw it. When he saw it, he's like, and he was coming. Like that turkey, had he not seen anything, he would have walked right to us to try to jump on that. He would have not done it. He would have eventually got nervous and probably flew off. And then he would have had a hard shot. So when he was standing still at literally 15, 20 yards. Yeah. Yeah, you got Bro, I couldn't even see him. Man, a little thunder chicken. Who shot it? You did cold? CP. Wow, bro, you shot him? Bro, he was kicking afterwards for like 10 minutes. Was he really? Yeah, so bad for him. Oh, I'm sorry, man. But he said we can eat him today. Oh, f let him rest a day, huh? We'll let the Lord f deal with it for a little while. Whoa, whoa, bro, his legs still got a little bit of lively in it. Bro, Caleb went a little Navy SEAL on us, Thee. That's not true at all. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, dang. If that's the Navy SEALs, we're in trouble. Doesn't that feel weird? Bro, this is what feels weird is that this thing. Oh, you gotta make your little wallet out of that. It's yeah. very nice. What is that, Mogadishu or something? <laughs> <laughs> How old is it? Two years old. Is that really old or not? That's a mature, he's mature, so, so yeah, he's a two year old. Long beard. He's what mature, you, you sound like <laughs> one of my friends in a court case, dude. <laughs> <laughs> That's just how. <laughs> That's what, yeah, he, he ain't going well, to juvie court. Guys, he ain't going um, to juvie court. He went, he went to full grown man. Right. He was judged as a man, he'll be eaten by a man. So it's then got up lunchtime, Theo, Caleb, they got kind of hungry, so last day they want to go back and um, and eat. And I want to kill a turkey, and I'm gonna see if I can't get one out here before we leave, and then maybe I can go back and eat lunch with them still. So uh, let's do it, baby. And we got one hour left, and uh, the good news is, Pat Howell, a good buddy, DE and I have been hunting all morning with Caleb and the guys, and Theo, but he saw a group of turkeys out in the burn. And it was a two or three gobblers strutting with quite a few hens. So we uh, at least know we got something to pick at, but it's nearly impossible to get these, you know, these gobblers away from these hens, especially in open spots. But we just want to get aggressive. We only got about an hour left and we all got to get to 
place cleaned up and clean out and get ready for the next group. Actually, I think Nate Hosey is coming in here to hunt, and so we got to get our room kind of halfway straightened out of here so we can get ready for Nate to come in. And then plus, I got to get back my little boy's ball game. And you know what? I'm gonna try to get your turkey, Theo. Here we go. <laughs> Two got him. Last one's coming up, see him. Yeah. <sighs> yes. We gotta leave here in an hour. We saw some turkeys out in the field. We kept yapping, we couldn't get them, we couldn't get them to break and we was wondering what's going on. And we look and there's a there's an irrigation ditch right here. We knew it was there, but we thought it was dry. And we finally just kept working, calling, working, calling. And finally, dude, these turkeys kind of pop up literally five steps from us. And it's not that great a hunt, but they was coming to check us out and we finally was able to get a shot. Like I say, not award winning, but we come to get us an Osceola and we did it. I'd rather my man Theo Vaughn got one, but you know, it, it seems easy to kill a turkey, but boy, it can be so aggravating and frustrating. And you think about a turkey being not that smart and by rule, they're not brilliant. They like love this time of year and a little food here and there, but uh, sometimes you got to grind. Here it is and got up in the middle of the day, hot Florida sunshine, but we keep grinding. And you know what? Even though they had hens, they, they did come investigate just enough to give us a shot. So, not award winning, but we won. And I like to win when I'm chasing turkeys. Fine, I'll dunk. Fine, I'll dunk. Let's see what we got. They come off the chair several times. Huh? Yep, what we've come for. Look at that, jet black. I don't know how much you could see. Possibly a three-year-old, long beard. Oh yeah. I've been coming down here for a long time and I thought this would be the perfect place. Um, Pat, Howell, Heather, Karen, my buddy D.E. This place is just uh, it's special. Since 96, I missed a few years, but 95 or 96 this is my first time coming down here to South Florida to hunt Osceola's. And I got me one. And now here it is, 2023. And now I brought some of the, my better friends to experience this place from personalities to just family. And I love, love, love to take people hunting, especially to get their first turkey, but sometimes everybody ain't gonna love it like we do and just get, get that turkey scratch fever. But son, let me tell you, I still got it after all these years. And sometimes you get great footage and sometimes you just get a turkey's head and his an old noggin getting knocked a loop. And that's what we did. But you, you gotta take what the turkeys give you. And they didn't give us a whole lot today. They're in a weird stage. We've definitely seen some hens that's nesting. These gobblers are with the hens, but they're not hardcore with the hens. So you can pull them off with a decoy. And then every once in a while you catch one by themselves. But these turkeys was with the hens pretty good, but not enough stuck to them that we could manipulate them in once we got within literally 60 yards of them. And we're just calling, 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 and we finally got a visual on them, but we saw them. The good thing about this cattle country is pretty open, so uh, I don't know, man. I love it. Caleb got a turkey. We've had Jim Brewer get a turkey. Theo didn't get a turkey, but you know what? We got them out here in South Florida, enjoyed this while with us, and uh, look forward to hanging with them again soon. So Theo, I just shot your turkey. Still love you, brother. Still love you. <laughs>
I, I still you, love it. We couldn't get, we kind of want to come out on this point, but it was just a wall and we couldn't, we had to come up below. And dang, if them turkeys were under that tree, but they had then got to the side and we just kept yelping, kept yelping. And they was coming down this ditch, but right up there, we couldn't bring them all the way across. But we got right here and I was like, oh goodness. And there was hens right here. And I was like, oh, that gobbler. And about that time, I looked and the gobbler's coming and he walked up up there. I shot him at probably five steps. It was unbelievable. <laughs> and it, it's not like your, it's not like your footage of turkey strutting coming from way off. It's just turkeys coming up half strutting, a couple heads. And the first one's kind of, I could have shot and they walked off. And then that la third one, like he hadn't seen nothing yet. So he come right up in there like, where y'all going? There's a hen over here. Boom, boom, and then he kind of got a little nervous, like walk off, and I said, "Nope, too late." To watch more, go to My Outdoor TV.